We are growing. We've increased by 35% in the last two years. And we are now ranked among the top 13 uh, fastest growing community colleges in the country. And we are the fastest growing in the state of Illinois. The master plan is a series of projects that will allow us to grow and accommodate the needs of the students and the community. First of all, we have a multi-purpose classroom building so that we can have students from our Fountain Square Center campus move here and have state-of-the-art facilities. We also have a library building. Uh, our current library, uh, 40 years old, was at a time when our enrollment was only 2,500. Today we have over 12,000. Health and Life Sciences Center will allow us to expand our health programs. We've had some growth in the last few years. That growth has not included the health areas. Over 60% of all healthcare professionals in the country are trained at community colleges. We want to be sure that we respond effectively to this community by training the healthcare professionals. And then we have the Public Safety and Sustainability Center that will be located outside this campus to take care of all the, um, the fire training, the police training, the emergency medical training, and then all the green related professions that are now the, the future. Uh, we'll be able to locate them at one place and then make sure that we respond to that. And then this campus is 40 years old. And so we need to address the infrastructure, uh, the parking lot, uh, the older buildings inside to make sure that they meet contemporary standards. Those are, in, in a nutshell, the projects under the master plan. Benefit to the community. First of all, these projects had a earmark of local economic development. You have the architects as local, construction management companies local, we had a private labor agreement with unions here. And so all the employees, uh, the people who are working here, are local. There was a study done by Northern Illinois University that said every dollar you invest in a community college, you get $3 back, okay. which means the $178 million translates to over half a billion dollars here and with all, all the arrangements whereby it's local economic development. And so these facilities allow us to accommodate the needs of this community. We are very appreciative to our district for the support it has provided us to be able to accomplish these projects. ECC will continue to serve this community well. Thank you very much.